moment. I'll put it on hold. Just one moment, sir. Yes, ma'am. The YMCA of Great. Hello, may I help you? How you doing? My name is Tyrone. I came in here into the YMCA as a guest about two, two and a half hours ago. Um, see, I, I got out of the, the, I went in the locker room after a workout. I was, I was kind of sweaty, so I decided to get in the shower. And when I came out, there was this man. He approached me. He's, he's like blonde hair, about five eight, kind of stocky. And did, have you seen anybody that fits that criteria? Oh gosh, I don't know. I mean, I we I can have to look at cameras and stuff. But what happened? It's just. It was really disturbing for me, ma'am. I didn't. I was just dumbfounded. He approached me and he's like, "You got something on your leg there," and he said, I didn't. Excuse me. I'm sorry. What did he say? He said I had something on my leg. Oh. Okay. And, then, and he approached me and he he touched like he didn't touch my genital area, but he touched the inner thigh, like my inner thigh, and he wiped mm-hmm. it and he's like. He's like, never mind, I just got it. But there was nothing on my leg. I just got out of the shower. Mm. Ma'am, it's like, I love the YMCA. I'm pretty much sure I'm going to get a membership. I just, nothing against you, your staff, or your faculty. Mm -hmm. You have a great, you have a great place. It's just this one man just came in sexually assaulted. Gave you an uneasy feeling, yeah. Yes, ma'am, yes, ma'am. I don't know what we're... I don't know what we're going to do about this, but, I mean, it was just, it was, I'm a pretty big man. I mean, I could fend for myself, but Mm -hmm. I just do not like being touched like this. Right. And what did he do? Like, rub it like he was brushing something off or? Yes, ma'am. He came, he was like, you got something on your leg there. Uh, And I was just, I looked down and and then he just proceeded to touch my inner thigh and act like there was Mm. something there, but there was nothing there. Hmm. That's strange. Um, well, I first of all, I apologize. Um, we don't condone that. Um, my thing is, is it's hard to go back at this point to try and find out who he is. Can you um, not check the, uh, the the cameras? There are so many people probably fit in that description, and we can look. But I could to, give you probably a time window of five minutes when it happened. Yeah, but he was in the lockers. We don't have cameras in there. It would have what to be about when he was coming in now. I can give you about coming five minutes. Coming in because of yeah. Do you know when he left the the locker room? I know when I left the locker room, and you could maybe guess. I can give you an estimate. I texted my I texted my brother Tyrese what happened. Let me let me go through my text messages real quick. Mm-hmm. I can tell you the time it happened at. It was at one second. 2.37 is when I walked out of the locker room. And I, cause like, I texted my brother Tyrese. I'm like, this nigga touched my leg when I was in the shower. And and then that was at 2.37. Right when I walked out, I had a phone in my hand. Mm-hmm. I texted him. Is there any way you could check the check the time for that? I will definitely have the um, facility manager check that. And But could you tell me about how old was the man? He was probably about, he looked like mid mid-20s. Mid-20s. Yes, ma'am. And he's he about 5'8", blonde hair, stocky. Yeah, he, so he, he was pretty stocky. He was pretty, he was well built. He was wearing a Aeropostale shirt. He was, I'm trying to remember, it, it was like blue. And it had like an 89 or something on it. And he was wearing some skinny jeans. It was, I didn't expect him to be wearing that. He just came out of the middle of nowhere. And like I said, he, he came up to me. I get out of the shower, butt naked. And he said, mm-hmm. you got some on your leg there. And I'm. And like I said, I looked at him like, what the hell is he talking about? I ain't got nothing on my leg. And he just proceeds to touch my inner thigh. Did you say me? Did, yeah, did I said, what the hell? Why'd you just do that? And he's like, he's like, I got it. Never mind. And I'm like, and then I, I just grabbed my clothes, put them on and walked out. And then I texted my brother Tyrese. All right. We are going to look at the cameras, but um, I do apologize for that. Um, I did you mention you came in as a guest today? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, yeah. Were you with would, someone at the time? No, ma'am. I would be happy to drive down there and mm-hmm. to speak with you guys and mm-hmm. look through the cameras and point them out. Yeah. I first let me try and get the um, facility guy. Let me talk with him. Can I have your number? Yes, ma'am. 
704. Okay. 713. 713. Okay. Yes, ma'am. 3589. Okay. Um, my name's Sonora, and I'm going to talk with him, and we're just going to kind of look at them and see what we can come up with, and one of us will call you back, okay? Yes, ma'am. Would you like my name? It's Tyrone, right? And what's yes, your last name? My last name is Johnson. Johnson. Okay. Perfect. Um, all right, Tyron, I really, really appreciate you calling us, and um, one of us will get back with you shortly, okay? Okay, yes, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, thanks. Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs>